Tracking and monitoring student progress in Moodle. If you don't see these checkboxes on your course page, open the gear icon and go to settings. Scroll down and change the completion tracking option to yes. Now you should have the checkboxes on your course page. After turning on the completion tracking, if you don't see the checkbox for some or all activities, it means that those activities do not indicate a course completion option. You can enable or disable activity completion tracking for individual items. Drop down the edit option for the activity and select the edit settings option. Scroll down to the activity completion settings. There you will find three options. Do not indicate activity completion. Students can manually mark activity as completed. Show activity as complete when conditions are met. The first one means you don't want to track it. With the second choice, you give students the chance to mark the activity as done on their own. With the third option, you can specify requirements that must be met in order for it to be marked as finished. A checkbox with a solid border indicates that the student must manually mark it as completed while one with dotty border indicates that once the student meets the requirements, it will be done automatically. Now let's see how you can monitor student's progress. If the course completion status block is added, students can see their progress during the course. Lecturers can view the overall progress of students. To add the block to the dashboard, turn page editing on. Click the hamburger button on the top right corner. Scroll down to the bottom of the left panel. Click the add a block link. Select completion progress. That's it. Now you can view an overview of student progress by clicking on the button. If you have any questions, you can contact me via my blog, inshallah.